Hey guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. My name is Samson, the Rodney. Today we are actually touring a very good neighborhood that is called uh, John Howard. So this is the neighborhood we will be touring today. But also what is special is that uh, this neighborhood is actually sandwiched between uh, uh, Jack Compound and um, the area called Chawama. So it's about two kilometers away from Musaka CBD. So that's the neighborhood we will be touring today. If you're new on my channel, kindly consider subscribing turn on the bell notification so that whenever we post a video you guys don't miss like any single of my apples. My name is Samson, the Roadman. Let's get started. Alright guys, so we are going to start our video from here today. This is a rail line here. This side is Livingstone. On this other side is uh, Lusaka's CBD. But then there's a road on the other side again which is called Estalungu Road and uh, this one takes you to town but it passes through it passes through um, Chawama so this is the area that we are touring it's called uh, John Howard okay John Howard you can even read even on that gate there so John Howard that's a neighborhood that we'll be touring today it's a very 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 unique neighborhood so we're going to walk around and show you guys how it is. So like starting from here, there's uh, here there's actually a community school which is called uh, John Howard Community School. Okay, let me show you guys. Actually, it's good to have like community schools because those people that uh, those people that can't manage to send their children to these other schools. They can actually bring them here. Okay. You can see here. That's, that is it. That's John Howard Community School. And this is also the John Howard Ward 3 office for the council. Okay, and there's a church over there as well. Okay, guys. So let us. Uh, let us walk around and show you guys how this neighborhood is. John Howard Community School. Okay, cool. So, so you can see guys, the buses are very busy. They're all heading into town. Heading into town. this side oh, nice so this other side yes you see it's uh, John Howard police post and this other side yeah that's a police post too yeah. Okay guys, so here there's another school which is called Happy Hours Trust School. There's a school here in uh, John How in John Howard. A school called Happy Hour. Happy Hours Trust School. Good. And here there's a very nice road. <laughs> So guys, we are walking around uh, the neighborhood that is called uh, John Howard. You know, John Howard. So yeah, for starters, let me show you a bit of. Uh... So guys, uh, so guys, let me tell you a bit of history about uh, this neighborhood, so-called John Howard. So like this, uh, in the this neighborhood is actually located on the southern part of Osaka. But then, in the southern part of Osaka, there used to be like this big farm who was called uh, John Lake. Now, John Lake used to live at this farm with his wife and children. But then, one of his daughters got married to a young man who was called John Howard. So, they ended up 
giving that young man a land <coughs> which is this side <coughs> and uh, afterward after those you know the white settlers were gone uh, they named this area as John Howard after the same young man who married John Lang's daughter you know so yeah that's how the name came about but then uh, yeah let's get to tour it and show you guys how it is how beautiful it is you know so let's Okay guys, so this is how John Howard looks like. Here again, there's another school, which is called uh, Crayford Nursery and uh, Primary School. And right here, there's also a beautiful church. Okay. So, uh, that is it. But this area is known as John Howard. Guys. John Howard. Okay. Let's see here. There's Pentecostal Holiness Church. So they have quite a number of churches here. Then this one is called uh, Pilgrim Wesleyan Church of John Howard. Pilgrim. Okay, so that's the church there. This one looks like it's a very old church. Yes, guys. Very, very old church, actually. So the whole lot of this area used to be farms, guys. Um, it used to be farms. The whole lot of this area. Farms, 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 farms. Okay. So in case uh, you're just joining us, because this is a premiere, I want to believe. Um, so John Howard, there's, there's a neighborhood called John Lang. John Lang used to own like, uh, he had a very big farm in the southern part of uh, Lusaka, where this neighborhood is. It's actually like just uh, like two kilometers away from Lusaka CBD actually. So he used to have a very big farm, John Lay used to have a very big farm, a very well-known uh, farmer in this area. And uh, so, like in Lusaka, most of the neighborhoods are actually named after uh, big farmers that lived there before. So, like John Lay had a very big farm, one of the biggest farms in the southern part of Lusaka. And hence, there's a neighborhood which is called uh, John Lay. But now, you know settled in this particular area and that's why the neighborhood is called John Howard today you know so that's just a, a bit of history about this neighborhood that we are touring today okay about the neighborhood we are touring today guys so, so if, you see, if you see such you know that uh, people are fixing things have like people that are fixing things there. Yeah. So here there's Gospel of Grace Ministries. Gospel of Grace Ministries. So that's, this is how it is. This is uh, how John Howard looks like. So in other words, John Howard is in Pongo, see? John Lang. <laughs> because he's a Kwatila, Mwana wa John Lang. Let me just show you something. This side is... Uh, Zambia National Assemblies of God Church 
in the John Howard branch. This is the John Howard branch, anyway. Okay, guys. So, this is it. So, let us walk around this side. Well, first, let me show you this area here. So, this side is a satellite foundation center. So, here they do lots of. Uh, it's more like a community school, kind of. Okay, but this is also Church of Christ. Church of Christ over here. Okay, guys. So, guys, we are walking around John Howard. What I like about this, actually, guys, what I like about these neighborhoods here, they have like so many churches. Take a look. There's a church there, there's a church there. So, it's more like this part was. Uh, this part was left for churches. As you can see, there's another one there. You know, but let's turn into this street. You know, and uh, just walk around and show you guys how it is. You know? Yes, so the government had introduced uh, havers, you know, like building roads in this manner. You can see the pavers, but let me know what you think, guys. If this is a good initiative, instead of putting like tar on this one, they decide to put like the pavers, like as you can see. Yeah. Which one would you actually prefer? The pavers, the pavers look okay. You know, very much okay, I think, for me. But let me know what you think in the comments, guys in the comments down below let me know what you think yes guys okay cool guys so let us continue walking around the john howard neighborhood right here right here guys. Uh, this is it. Uh, so there are parts, of course, that uh, that look beta, you know, beta. Yes, yes. They've got nice houses. Yes, here in John Howard. So this is more like a market. Here, there's a market behind this. Very good market, actually. Very good market. Let me show you this side. Like in many, in many, many neighborhoods, you find that they've designated an area for charcoal. And uh, this area looks like it used to be for charcoal, as you can see. The charcoal, charcoal, charcoal. But uh, there isn't charcoal anymore. So the covers, I think they look nice. But this is it, this is Jack. These are very old houses. Like this one here. And this one is quite new. Because so people are always upgrading, which is good. You know, people are always upgrading. Yeah. 
As you can see, like this one, very, very old house. Very, very old house. This one. <coughs> and you can see, because uh, the former president actually came from this kind of neighborhood, like Chawama. So, um, this one, the John Howard neighborhood that we are touring today. It's uh, between Chawama and uh, Jack, Jack Compound. So like uh, Jack Compound, in between Jack Compound and Chawama, there's uh, John Howard, which is uh, this neighborhood we are walking through today. Okay, this is it, this is the neighborhood called uh, John Howard. So the former president, Edgar Lungu, used to live in Chawama. Okay. This is it. John Howard looks like this. So it's about uh, two. It's about uh, two kilometers. Two kilometers from uh, the Saka CBD. You are in John Howard. Now this is a problem here. If you look at this, the water when it rains it becomes stagnant like this. So this gives rise to certain diseases such as cholera and bihazia. So this is not good. Okay. Okay, so it's hot today, guys. Hopefully, it's going to rain. Yeah, but we are here in uh, John Howard, and uh, so yeah, let's keep touring this area. Show you guys the John Howard. I like the way the you know these so-called uh, pavers are waking right here because this area is actually waterlogged like I said earlier uh, but uh, this helps when it rains you know, helps but I don't know what could be the cost of putting such kind of a road like pavers on the road instead of the tar. Which one is more affordable? Or yeah, which one is more affordable between the two? Alright guys, thank you so much for coming back to the channel. Hope you found value from what we've shared with you today. And if you have please remember to like the video, subscribe, turn on the bell notification so that whenever we post a new video you guys don't like really miss any single of my upload. My name is Samson the Roadman. I'll see you in my next one. Bye bye for now. Take care of yourselves.